Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition where that man has my heart forever and always and what I think I'm going to do is actually go get the Reaper IFF right now. It's not endgame, um, but it is getting, like, that is like the penultimate mission, I think, technically, before we have to go through the actual Omega 4, or Omega Relay. Um... I have just saved, so if I'm wrong, I can come back. But there is something that happens on the Reaper IFF where I will acquire an individual that I have been trying the more I play this game to get as early on as possible. Because, um, again, for those of you who haven't played, uh, I know specifically it was um, Christopher who noticed, <laughs> my treat to your patron, that there's still an empty slot for a companion. And we get that companion. I am 95% sure we get that companion at the Reaper IFF. Commander, what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to Kay. do, Shepard. Maybe another time. Mm, goodbye. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. So I just want to make, I just want to run through really quick and make sure everybody's good to go. I can't believe the collectors were once Protheans. Garrus has a mission still. I pictured Protheans being regal, not giant bugs. bugs. Who knows what the Reapers did to them? Creep. Yeah, well, they, you think that until freaking the third game, and then you're like, oh no, they actually completely changed the design for the Protheans. Pretty sure. Uh, let's feed my fish. Um... Hello, new fish that I definitely won't kill. Um, at some point, maybe, no, I think it's in Mass Effect 3 you get the jellyfish, because uh, that's when I truly shine. Anyway, I'm sort of distracted, but I think for the most part, especially for Tally's mission, I know that this new individual that we're going to get, I want that individual for Tally's mission specifically, and also this individual in order to get all of their dialogue, um, like that you can kind of go back after like main missions, you know, and people's dialogue will progress, um, and let you get to know them and stuff like that. Um, it's really difficult if you just wait till the end of the game, essentially, like you've like done everything, and then you go get the Reaper IFF, you get this new individual, and it's like, oh, well, I don't get to know you very well because it's basically the end of the game, you know? So, I've been trying to get this individual no you, earlier. Mm, the DLC one I don't really like. We'll try that one. What the heck from tombs you did the buddy act when I had the gun on the oh that's right this guy he was the one who was um, technically actually a background for Shepard you're the if you're the sole survivor um, of the Thresher Maw attack he's actually the second survivor tests were done on me that you can't even imagine for years Cerberus did them now you're teaming up I got my own Merc team now Shepard not kill any Shepard or Cerberus team I find if I run into you don't expect any different listen dude I respect it but you're not gonna be able to do that <laughs> this is that this is that uh Krogan that we helped <laughs> The clan leader told me how to get in touch with you. I don't remember much what happened, but the chief scout said you pulled my quad out of the fire when I got caught. Or, yeah, when I poisoned over at the warlock camp. Thanks. Next time I have a chance to kill a human, I won't. Unless I go into a blood rage or something. Thanks. I got to go to the female camp after I recovered, and it was pretty good. I was actually thinking of joining the blood pack before this happened. I think I'm going to stay here instead. Which is good. That's what we want. We want more Krogan hanging out at home. Not just, like, you know, doing nothing, but, like, trying to, like, improve their lives and the lives of their people, you know. Even in little ways, you know. Oh, uh, do you have anything to say? I bumped into Zaid recently. Quite the character. Given how much violence and destruction that man's seen, he's surprisingly well adjusted. Still, I wouldn't want to be alone with him. Well. Anyway, what's up? That sounds like quitting talk. <laughs> it sounds like a coward talk. That'll be all. Just kidding. It's always nice chatting with you. Just kidding. <laughs> if he is not your style, do not stay in a room alone with him. He would never do anything, like, super bad, but he'd be scary. <laughs> oh, I was- uh, No, we're not gonna help Garrus right now. Oh, no, what am I doing? I'm not trying to go there. I need to go to the Mass Effect Relay. 
and we are going because the thing is too is that my my initial plan for this individual in order to like help get um you know the checkpoints done essentially to allow us to talk to them more um i have all the dlcs so i was gonna wait to do the dlcs until i got this person so that and i think that's how a lot of people did it back in the day um is is you just kind of would would take them through the dlcs um but where do we where is oh here it is okay is that right there yeah this may be this may be a bad idea honestly but um again i've played this game a lot but I don't remember most of what I do and most of, like, the secret. People are so good at it. People will remember so much. Like, another one, like, um... Brain Conqueror in the YouTube comments also. Freaking... They know everything. <laughs> and, like, so many people, like, that I talk to just in general. Like, in, like, my Discord and stuff like that. Like, people just know things. And I... And they remember things. And I remember, like, half. I don't know, and I've played these games a few times each, which I know isn't the, like, several that a lot of people have played, but still. I'm like, man, <laughs> I need to, need to, need to up my game, I don't know. I just think I have a goldfish memory, and I remember the things that stood out the first time I played, and then anything else after that is just uh, icing on the cake. <laughs> And also, I think it doesn't help that, like, I play this while talking and trying to be somewhat entertaining. Like, uh, it distracts from my goldfish brain. Can only handle so many things at once. Oh, this is one of those ones that has, like, potentially secret archaeological significance. Early probes of this, um, not this one, but the... Right? The one next to it? Oh no, the star? It is luminous and radiates more heat than it receives from the star Thorn. Early pros of Thorn? That, that has to be a mistype. That has to be they actually meant this planet, because... Yeah, that doesn't- yeah, that has to be this planet. No, that's a star. That's- they're ta the Thorn is the star, and I don't think there's no way that that's gonna happen. You're not gonna have something in the star. But maybe you would. I don't know. And I know you technically have winds on a star, but it makes more sense for a gas giant like this. Is it a gas giant? It looks like one. This is a young brown dwarf. This is also a star? It's a brown dwarf? Brown dwarfs are stars, aren't they? I'm so sorry. I know, I'm pretty sure we have an astronomer in the squad. In the squad. Um, <laughs> and I'm, I just, I'm an idiot, as we've, st as we've established. Um... Yeah, it's some nuclear fusion still grows its depth. Yeah, it's a star. This is a star too, but there's two stars. You can't have two stars that close to each other, right? Am I? I am looking this up. They are failed stars. Brown dwarfs are failed stars. Not massive enough to power hydrogen fusion reactions, but this one still has some nuclear fusion going on in its depths. So they're not a planet and they're not a star. Also, again, for the record, I do read all these planet entries. It's one of my more favorite things to do, just as I'm scrolling around. But, I realize me taking time to read every single one is probably not in everyone's best interest, <laughs> so I don't do that. But if I find cool ones, I try to point them out. Oh my gosh, it's so scary. Even dead. Even dead. It's scary. Orbiting Nemocene is a two kilometer long ship with the unmistakable profile of a Reaper. It's giving off power sensors in localized areas, but they are far weaker than a ship the size would indicate. The Reaper seems to maintain a mass effect field that has kept it from falling into the failed star, but massive holes have been blasted and melted into parts of the hull and remain unrepaired. The only logical conclusion is that the Reaper died or was at least reduced to minimal functioning a long time ago. Just you guys wait. It's the ultimate spook fest. We get to walk through its body. Yeah, I get it. I know. If I leveled up, I will do that. Okay, who do I want to bring? I'll definitely bring thing. Who are we going to be fighting? We're going to be fighting. Oh. 
see, Grunt's always a solid choice, honestly. And I think we're gonna be fighting collectors, not Geth. Maybe both. I don't freaking know. We're doing our- we're gonna do our best, it's fine. Shockwave! Wider impact radius, taking everything out in a broad strip. Yes, not the long path. I want the AoE one. Fortification, yeah. Treasure. Where is... Oh, is that his spe- it is a special. Heck. I thought he had the, um... Oh my gosh, what is the one that Caden has in Mass Effect 1? The, like, uh, neural? The neural one? The neural attack? I thought he had that. Make sure everybody... We got everybody... Yeah, perfect. Missile launch? Do I want the missile launcher? I think for this one I actually want the collector particle beam. Star Wars. What's with all the chop, Joker? Doing my best. The wind's gusting to 500 kph. What's with all the chop, Joker? <laughs> There's a second ship alongside the Reaper. It's not transmitting any IFF, but the radar paints its silhouette as Gath. I guess we know why the science team stopped reporting in. Oh, really? What just happened? The Reaper's Mass Effect fields are still active. We just passed inside their envelope. Oh my gosh, it's so scary. I am a hurricane, huh? It's so, that's very accurate, yeah. Okay, get ready for a spook fest, oh boy. Uh, smells bad. There's blood, but something's wrong with it. Mm-hmm. I need that money. I actually meant to get some upgrades before coming in here, but alas, this is uh, this is the life we live. This is the uh, this is the path we chose. Just money from that. Oh, here we go. Here we go. indoctrination sending them in was a really terrible idea like we know that the reapers have indoctrination like they have mind control and yes this one may be dead or inert but like you had to come into this expecting potentially that like and there's no way to block it as far as i know you can't like put like a freaking um eh, you can't put a freaking what do you want to call it? Um, actually, frick, I should have brought... Should I have brought Tally? I'm actually gonna hang... I might I might actually reload, because I might actually want to bring Tally just for kicks because of a certain thing that happens. I don't know if it'll let me. Nope. I'll be back. Basically, what I was saying, you can't bring a tinfoil hat to, like... Not because we all freak out. They look very similar. You can't bring a tinfoil hat block like a reaper indoctrination you know what i mean like there's nothing i know of that i can think of but as we've i haven't brought tally out at all i am the worst um but we all have established that i have the memory of a goldfish so i actually want to get the combat drone upgraded Let's do this. 
I'm t I, I the more I play the more often I try to like lean towards the more like passive abilities oftentimes where it's like the tech and biotic like and durations and stuff are boosted um and not just weapon damage however I feel like her abilities while good there's just not a ton of them and that's kind of how everybody is and I'm just kind of like eh, like they don't do like her drone does do a lot of damage the AI ha I mean it wouldn't be bad but I think for her since she's more regular with like she has more consistent damage with her weapons than with her abilities I'll probably go with this but that could be a really stupid but either way like you still get you still get bonuses it just kind of depends like you get the same bonuses the same things increase just depends on the percentage so I also want to keep her alive a little more so it's plasma shotgun mm, I don't know and I did oh I almost didn't change to the collector particle beam sorry we'll be back We're back. Three to B O one six. No evidence of active nanotechnology noted. Doctor Chindana believes they would have decayed over the last thirty-seven million years. There's not enough data to support his claim. He asserts that the truth is patently obvious. I am concerned. Chindana has been staring at the samples for hours. He says he's listening to them. Mm-hmm. It's already begun. Anyway. We'll see. Oh my gosh, it just looks so nice. I really like it. It would have been cool if they'd made her face but like kind of gold. That would have been really cool. Also, I switched their weapons. I have the shotgun, she has the pistol, he has the shuriken. SMG. Oh boy. What just happened? The Reaper put up kinetic barriers. I don't think we can get through from our side. Oh, how convenient. As curious as I am about the Reapers, I'd rather not be trapped inside one. We'll have to take down the barrier generators from in here. Any idea where they are? At the moment of activation, I detected a heat spike in what is likely the Rex Mass Effect core, sending the coordinates now. Be advised, this core is also maintaining the Reaper's altitude. So when we take the barriers down to escape, the wreck falls into the planet core. And that means everyone dies. Yeah, I got it. If any helmsman can pull us off this thing before it reaches crush depth, it's you. We'll make a sweep for survivors and recover what data we can. Stand by. Aye aye. Good hunting. Joker's like, I know. Also, the, this is. I've heard stories about this sort of atrocity. I thought they were exaggerated. <laughs> they did not die pleasantly. You're married? You never mentioned that. Katie had anger management issues. When my brother got married, the best man tried to hit on her. She kicked him down the church steps. But what? Katie's my wife. I, I, I must have told you this story. No, I know my wife. I remember that day was the only time I saw her wear stockings. Yeah, the, the kind with seams up the back. That's what I remember too. What the hell is this? How can we remember the same thing? It sounds like the Reaper was affecting their minds. Mm, there's actually a good line that kind of explains it coming up soon. But uh, yo, this is what this was all like Cerberus tech stuff, right? Like. It's like, oh wow, the inside of the Reaper looks like a regular spaceship. No, it does not. This is what the inside of a Reaper actually looks like. I need to get through here. We've got trouble. Yeah. No, 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 not you, no. <laughs> oh. Please, no. Oh wait, oh for combat, I need to switch things up, I apologize, and we're going mouse and keyboard. My hands are jittery, I need to throw away the rest of this coffee, holy cow. I had wondered if the technology to make husks came from the Geth, or Sovereign. Geth origin never made sense to me. This confirms it's from the Reapers. 
Tally is good to bring on this one. I know you're coming. I know. I was like, I knew. Yeah. Oh, wow. That was quite the spread. Oh, I should put on incendiary ammo. He already has the... Okay. I believe in you guys. Okay, or... They, I was like, I... <laughs> Weapons ready. That's good, that's good. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Oh, I need to remember the buttons. Oh, whoopsie, whoopsie, whoopsie daisy, whoopsie daisy. <laughs> Look ahead. Again? I don't like. I don't like this at all. Soften them up. But this is why I have the shockwave. Is for these husks in particular. Maybe I will switch to my pistol since I'm trying to keep my distance right now. I'm just trying to get the lore. Oh my gosh. Let me have the lore. <laughs> Third day with this headache. You'd think Chandana would have let me have a few hours off. God damn! What? That thing, that just gray thing, it, it disappeared when I looked straight at it. It came out of the damn wall where we took off that panel. I didn't see anything. You should lie down. I'm telling you, the ship isn't dead. It knows we're inside it. Calm down. Now I'm getting a headache. They're breaking down. Honestly, I would have just left. Like, you guys, they know about Reaper indoctrination. Like, they know what it is. Sniper. Oh. We that's so weird. Someone else is still alive in here. They're a rather good shot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's always good to have a sniper give you uh, a, a, a raving recommendation of another sniper. This is valuable. <laughs> yeah. 